Alright, hi everybody, my name is Ross and today is September 2nd, 2011 and today we're going to review... <coughs> yeah, today we're going to review... Uh, I don't know. Seriously, I don't know, I have no idea. I got it. Panda Cloud. Okay, Panda Cloud. Now, this machine had been used before in a previous video. I think the... Um, the software's video, I believe, it was, it was used, but I'm pretty sure this, this computer is clean because I just did a skin with uh, him and Pro and uh, Malwarebytes. I mean, Malwarebytes and him and Pro. So let's see. Um, uh, let me. So we need, uh, let me pause the video. I'm going to grab Panda Cloud. Now, Panda Cloud, they have they have two types of. Um, they have uh, the paid version, I think the pro and the free version. Now, for this review, I'm going to test out the free version. Now, I will not review the paid version. This is my second time reviewing Panda Cloud. See, they have right here uh, Panda Cloud Antivirus Pro. So let's let's get the free version. Now, I'm going to make a review, a really special review, not on this, not on this channel, on the other channel, because I also made a rogue. Uh, soft, soft as at the end. I will, I will post the link in the description probably of the review of uh, another scam uh, product. Uh, it's called PC, uh, PC Maca dot com, I believe. PC Maca dot com. Uh, just in case, I'm going to show you the link. I'm not, I'm not going to review this product. Okay, yeah, PC, uh, PCMacca.com, it's the product that, um, it's gonna be next for my review. Um, I am pretty sure this, this, this thing is a piece of junk, actually, let me see. Uh, I, actually, I was watching a, a Fox Business Channel and I saw this commercial on TV and I wrote down the, the link that they were offering. Now, I'm pretty sure this is another scam, uh, bro, uh, Register scammer scam product. Uh, if I have time, probably re review it right after this review. No, I will not show you any um, commercials for copyright reasons, but I will not on this channel, my other channel. Yeah, basically this is the link. Um, but today we're going to review Panda, Pen Panda Cloud, not this product. If I have time, I will review this product next. No, as seen on TV, right? <laughs> no, I got some tips from other reviewers and uh, uh, one of my daily uh, watchers, whatever you call them, uh, he asked me to um, get uh, links and tr and get the EXEs and try to run a scan of uh, Panda Cloud, see how many you can pick, pick up. So if you're going to do uh, two types of scan, 30 links and a folder of uh, I think 200 um, viruses. Now I'll pause the video while it's installing because it's kind of boring and I'll be right back. No, I was about to grab the links, but it uh, looks like it's finished installing. Uh, <sighs> there's. Let me. Let's just uh, update this product and then we're going to uh, grab the links and hopefully be good to go now. Okay, um, just going to check my time because uh, I was flagged for copyright infringement on my channel. So, And the weirdest part is all my videos are mine. I just I just issues with the PC the I think PC iRobot or some other review. Yeah, I think it was PC iRobot the one that flagged me for copyright infringement. So uh, right now I had to watch out. I had I had to um, be extra careful. Now let me see. Uh, let me pause the video while something's going on. Uh, okay. Let me see. Am I uh, am I recording? Uh, yeah. Okay. Um. Right here. Actually, I'm definitely going to try the. Um, even they offer a pro a pro edition. I'm going to still try the free free edition. I will not. Uh, I will not upgrade to pro. Um. Let's. I hate it. No. Uh, what the heck is going on? Oh, it's doing some kind of scan or whatever. Um.
Uh, that was weird. Okay, let me grow. Um, now there's no way to update it, uh, update the spreader because it's a cloud-based uh, AV, so it's up to date. It's supposed to be up to date. So um, yeah, pretty much standard settings. No virus detected. Detected. Um, we should be good to go. Okay, I'm going, let, me go. let me grab the links. Okay, uh, looks like uh, a file is infected. It was okay, looks like you found some sort of file. I mean, this is this was this from my previous review. I'm still downloading the. Um, actually, I think it's, uh, it has to reboot for the installation or whatever. But I'm still trying to download um, whatever. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Oh, these are just uh, recycle files. I'm putting recycle bins. There's, um, I just put them in recycle bins, so they're they're not viruses. Oh wait, I forgot. This is not from the uh, Sophos review. This is the review from the uh, the failure review that that I'm that one I made. Uh, I think it was pen not uh, what's it called. Viper, yeah, Viper Home Premium. That's the failure review which I, I failed on. I uh, my uh, mic was disabled. I, I had to buy a new I had to, I had to buy a new microphone. Yeah, so um, let me just in case let me run a scan with Malwarebytes see if it picks up any infections. All right, I'm back. Uh, let's begin the review. <sighs> it took uh, quite a while for this to thing to install. Plus, I had to reboot like three times because it uh, for some reason it picked up. Uh, Files, which is were uh, were not even viruses. So uh, let's look, let's begin. Let's open the Internet Explorer, get the links. Thirteen links, like always. Now this is the last one. It's the Russian ransom malware, really risky one. I would um, definitely keep uh, keep a close eye on this one. Now, if anything works out, we probably will not even need. Um, Probably not even need the um, Malwarebyte Hitman Pro or whatever. So this is. Uh, Okay, the number one is blocked. Uh, under trend. Uh, okay, number one is blocked. Now we can check this and continue, but which we will not. So we're gonna leave this one alone. So number two. Now remember, these are zero day old. Well, some of them may be like three hours old. Number two is blocked. Number three, uh, K, uh, KR, KR, I have no idea where's KR. Three is blocked. This is a really, this is a bot, this is a bot. I believe it's a spy eye. Blocked. Number five, huh, looks like this thing is doing a fantastic job. For free AV? Hard to give a thumbs up. Oops. Oh, we're gonna let Malwarebytes decide that for us. Six. Damn. Okay, uh, the one the one that was neutralized, so that one was blocked. This is the fake flash update. Really difficult to remove. I mean, I actually I've seen this one for a few days already. In a while, so really hard to remove it. It's, it's basically a part of a <coughs> excuse me, a fake rogue. Um, it basically it hits like a, a por uh, adult websites or porno sites. Uh, 
gun. Now, watch out for. I have to be careful on number 13. This one's really risky. It's a Russian ransom malware. And one thing I have read online, most of Russian mal mal malware, ransom malware, whatever it's called, it hits only Russia, it doesn't hit U USA that much. So, Well, um, most of the time it's, uh, it doesn't hit uh, uh, American computers. It only pe hits people that go to uh, Russian uh, porno sites or doll websites. Uh, this is a link inside the exe, I believe it went through Russian ransom malware. It, this one is also was uh, it's blocked, so very good. Now, since uh, we can't run malware bytes, we're going to um, uh, actually, I'm sorry, let's run a uh, scan with uh, malware bytes and see how many picks up that we're going to do our on. We then we're going to unzip this folder and see how many things that I can pick up. Bear with me. Actually, while I'm transferring files, look, it's picking up uh, <coughs> viruses, so... Mm, there's something. I have to give a thumbs up to uh, this product. Now, um, looks like I'm uh, scanning malware, but it doesn't pick up any infections, so... I mean, um, looks like it's going to be sort of like a fail review, but uh, I would definitely say uh, malware, uh, not malware bytes. Why I keep saying malware bytes? Panda, um, Panda did a fantastic job against blocking all this malware. I mean, right now I'm trying to transfer uh, these uh, viruses into a folder. I should point this out there, uh, the scan. There's no point in me continuing the scanning it. Uh, right now I'm trying to transfer this virus into a folder. And look, it's, it's picking up the uh, viruses while it's being transferred. So, um,. Let's see, uh, I wonder how many, um, actually we can still finish up the review. Um, I'm going to see how many, add, um, how many actually it's going to leave in a folder and how many is going to like, it's going to be left in our, uh, in our, in a WinRAR file. Alright, here's all the files that, uh, well, I, I think I missed. Now let's see how many are in in this folder exactly. Okay, there's 90, 93 files that I miss. And let me see how much how much is in the rar file. Uh, uh, 332. So I found a lot of files. I mean, look, let me see. Is it still finding some... F uh, Infections, yeah. So, um, so let's see. Where's my calculator? So, uh, three hundred and twenty-two. Oops, um, three hundred and twenty-two uh, divided by uh, ninety-three. Ah, uh, oh, so it's um. No, you get the idea. So let's see, 332 um, minus uh, 93, and it found 290, uh, 219 files. So I would say that this product did a fantastic job against. Um, Zero uh, against. Um, I mean, I would have to say, Panda did a good job. Even for a free version, I would have to give a thumbs up. You know, if, I mean, I seen paid version of products uh, are the the worst. Um, whatever. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later on. Bye bye.